Hi, this is Paul, and welcome to my golf cave. I think I got my camera at a little bit of an angle here. Uh, yes, welcome to my golf cave. I'm going to be playing a new course on GS Pro today. It is, I believe it's called Hidden Valley Country Club. I think this is the mountain course, and it is created by the golf boy. So I've never played this course. It, uh, I believe it's true to life, not a fantasy course. So I think what I'll do is I'll play the first four holes. Let's just play four holes today. I have it set up on the yellow tees. So give or take, right, about 6,000 would be the total yardage for the 18 holes off of the yellow tees. So let me get going here. Grab driver. And I am currently using... Uh, the K2 golf tees. So if you can see that off to the side, hooked up to almost like I call it a sandbag, and then you place the ball on the tee, swing away, hooked up to a bungee cord, and so it won't go flying off to the uh, to the screen like the bird tees do. Anyway, enough talking. Let's see what we can do here. Decent strike. Hey, I'll take it. Not a tremendous amount of distance, but it's a good start. And what do we have to the hole? 149. We're not really going downhill. My 8-iron would get me to about 145 if I hit that well, sometimes further. Take out our 7. Did not strike that well at all, and that's why I end up in the sand. All right. Thirty-three yards. Make sure we get this out of the sand. That's the number one goal. Nice out. I think that's pretty good. I would have liked to have rolled a little further. And what are we looking at here? Ever so slightly left to right. Sorry about that. I'm running uh, a TV screen as well as uh, the image on my impact screen, and I was hoping to, uh, to be able to see this on um, both. Uh, not working at the moment, but that's fine. 11 feet 9 inches. Turn. Ah! And starting off with the bogey, but that's okay. The second hole is, what is it, 338 yards. All right. Let's see what we can do here. I need to get this set up so it'll do a flyover. Uh, and show me uh, show me what the uh, the hole would look like. Looks like it's ever so slightly dog leg to the right. And I would say that I hit that perfectly, but my foot slid a little bit. I'm starting to like my setup. Got to get used to it. New PC. Um, what else is different? I'm using the K2s for the uh, the T's. I have a new driver. Finally got it back. 102 yards. 
Yes, I finally got my new driver back. My buddy had been hitting it. And the deal is, is that I got a new driver a year ago and I flat out just couldn't hit it. Uh, I, was, I was here, there, and everywhere uh, with it. Just couldn't keep it in the fairway. And my friend hit it and uh, he says, yeah, yeah, can't, can't hit this thing here, there, and everywhere. I said, what's going on here? It's, it's a Cobra, replaced my previous Cobra head, except this is uh, sort of an up, updated version, a rad speed, and uh, it, it got good reviews on the internet and all that. So I said, what's going on here? And he says, let me hold on to it uh, for a little while longer. That little while longer was the, uh, over the winter, and he put a new uh, shaft on there. And all of a sudden light bulb went off and everything else and the uh, the club acted differently he says i can hit this now and he says paul he says go out and buy this specific shaft uh which i need to take a look at so i can tell you but um so i went out and did that and then all of a sudden i can hit it and first time out he's like oh wow you're hitting this well and then he says let me give it a try again he hit it he hit it well so shaft sometimes makes the difference second hole 102 yards good strike get up there stop 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 <laughs> Okay, a little bit left to right, not much, want to play for it though. Eight feet, three inches. Uh, let me know what you're working on uh, with your game. For me, it's, I'm always working on something, but, uh, but lately my swing path has been, oh, about eight to 10 inside. I had that same issue last year and I'm trying to do some practice where I can actually get that down to about two or, or so with, with full swings. Yeah, actually they tend to be shorter swings, but, uh, that's what I'm working on. Uh, eight feet, three inches. Not hard enough. Not hard enough. All right. Should be working on my putting, right? That was awful. Okay. 385. There we go. And let's see where I want to hit it. I'm looking down at the uh the map down there i don't see any hazards that really run into decent strike okay what do we have 130 are we going downhill at all no strong nine or a little bit easier eight <laughs> gonna go with the strong nine probably a bad move let's see what we can do was okay again in to out nine yards this one we're going to do a chip here 27 feet nine yards Stop, stop, stop. And that's good. Gimme zone. I'll take that for a par. 
One more. 171. Let's see. The one thing with the K2 is sometimes the, uh, the bungee cords get snagged amongst each other. 171. All right, looks a little bit of a tight fairway. We're going for the green, though. Who off to the right immediately knew that. All right, that's a mess. An absolute mess. Let's see if we can get out of this. Talking about 47 yards. I think what we'll do is we will pull out an eight iron, try to keep the ball low, get through this muck. Yeah. We got it through that. I had to get out of those, uh, the uh, trees. Now we've got 36 yards. Let's get this on the green. 36 yards from the rough. All right. Not strong enough. Well, it got up there. Hmm, better than I thought. Let's see what we can do about making a putt, huh? 14 feet, 5 inches. All right. If you have any questions about my setup here, whether it's launch monitor, the uh, software that I use, uh, hitting mat, anything whatsoever, uh, projector, just let me know. Uh, just, uh, uh, yeah, I, I had plenty of questions myself. I haven't done it the right way. Uh, there's always room for improvement like to have a 4K projector. I'd like to have a better hitting area. I'd like to take this uh, impact screen in the cage that I built and expand it, uh, take off the, uh, the garage door rails and make this larger. So there's, there's always something. 14 feet, 5 inches. Let's make a putt. Uphill slightly. <laughs> and there we go. So that's my four holes today at uh, Hidden Valley Country Club. It's the uh, the mountain course. I uh, believe it might be in Sandy, Utah. And uh, I'm going to play the rest of this course at some point. But uh, just wanted to give you uh, a little uh, hint, uh, a taste of uh, the first few holes. Anyway, first four holes. So thank you for joining me in my golf cave today. Very much appreciated. Thank you.